I tell you how much I appreciate your responses when all that stuff was happening about Tom Brady? I could, I could tell. I, it's love when you just you were so real about it because it rubbed you the wrong way. Like, I'm tired of hearing about Tom Brady. Like, we focus on what we need to do here. Mm. Yeah, yeah. That, uh, uh, it, it, it's kind of a thin line to walk, man. You don't, you don't ever – you know, you respect the game. You don't ever want to disrespect nobody, especially somebody like Tom Brady. But the, the way media and stuff was like trying to make paint – paint a picture of like – he ain't never lost or he unbeatable. It was, it was, it was kind of getting annoying. So, young fella, uh, what's it been like for you being in New England this year? Yeah, uh, it's, it's just it's been different. It's, it's been different. Uh, it's just a different system, uh, different, different principles, but at the end of the day, it's still, it's still football. So, you just you kind of go out there and you rely on, uh, you know, the film study and what you learn in the meeting. Then you, you go and try to execute. But uh, it's, it's been different, but it's been fun. I've yeah. been enjoying myself. Yeah. No, I, I, it looked like you enjoying yourself, especially as Jay asked you about Tom Brady and your response, your response to that was pretty, pretty good. Unfortunately, you were on the wrong side of a quarterback in Zach Wilson's injury on Sunday. What happened on the play that from your perspective? Because you know you know how the media will twist it and turn it. Uh I mean I, I kinda as he was releasing the ball, I was hitting him. And uh he kinda he kinda went down. And uh I don't really I don't really know what kind of happened as far as his injury. But uh I mean it it, it kinda he was out of the pocket and kinda just hit him. And uh I think I the thing is, you just never, you don't never, this, ga- this game, how it goes, uh, you know, everybody going to get injured, kind of, or Nick to nags and bang and bruise. Uh, but, like, a young guy like that, you don't never want to see him go down, uh, get injured, and then you hate to be the one that kind of was involved on the play. So, I just. I hope he. I hope him a speedy recovery and he get back, and get back uh, <laughs> to being a starting quarterback. But you know, uh, it it kind of, ha- you know, it's football. It's football. But you know, I just, I'm just praying for him and uh, his family, and and uh, hopefully he all right. Matt Judon joining us, Patriots linebacker, two time Pro Bowler, um, here on Keyshawn, J. Will, and Max. Matt, I got to ask you. You know. I, Obviously, I got a chance to play for Coach K, and, and things were very different as opposed to a lot of other coaches I played for. How are things different with Bill Belichick? Uh, so, uh, I mean, for, from the NFL, I only had two head coaches. Uh, I've been lucky in that regard. Uh, so, I mean, Bill, Bill is just Bill. Like, he, he, he is the person that, you see on TV or you see in the media, but uh, he just, he just way more comfortable with his team, you know? Uh, But uh, he just want to win. He just want to win games. Yeah. And it's all about football. And it's all about like, you know, how you approach the game and the uh, details and everything. And he can, he can correct anybody on uh, any play. You know how much football he actually actually watched uh, and coached and taught. So uh, he know he know every with every position or on a single play with everything it's supposed to look like. And so uh, and so I mean that's just that's just the person he is. But he he let us he let us go out there and put our own style on it, our own flair on it. But long as it's uh, like the picture that he had in his mind, he uh, find what however we executed. So uh, I mean, I I have enjoyed playing for uh, Coach Belichick. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube for live streaming sports and premium content. Subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.